Face Podcast. I am your host, Jada. So I am hosting. Is it something different? Well, I don't normally host. Yeah. <laughs> okay. I am your host. I will be hosting. <laughs> I am the host. I shall host the host. And me with the first podcast. It's like, welcome everyone to our podcast. This is our very first podcast. I hope you like this podcast. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, and then with me today we have Dakota. Yes, hello. And we have special guest Erin. Hi. <laughs> hello. Yeah. So, for our audio listeners, because this will be on Spotify. Oh, oh, oh. 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 Yeah. yeah. You, if you want to see obviously what we look like, you can go and check out our YouTube channel. There's probably a link somewhere in Spotify. I don't know how it works. I'm working on it. It's fine. We work. Mm-hmm. Anyway. <laughs> yep. Tell my brain I am with it. <laughs> <laughs> You're all good. Yeah. So we decided for this episode, the reason why I'm hosting, because normally you're used to Dakota hosting, is because Dakota and Aaron, this is kind of like their first proper one-on-one meeting. Wow. It's not one-on-one <laughs> 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 Leaves the room. <laughs> Sorry. One-on-two meeting then. This is the first time you guys have really like hung out with each other. Mm, yeah. I'm just yeah. outside of big gatherings, like, yeah, big big gatherings or parties. <laughs> and for the people who don't know, like Erin, we've known each other for 13 years now, which is wow. <laughs> pretty much if you think about it, every single person in primary school, we've been friends longer than they've existed. Both. <laughs> oh, look at us. Yes. yes. And then I feel like Dakota and I have been friends for an eternity, but we've been friends for like three years now. Yeah. So. Feels like yeah. 10 year no difference, time. yeah. It feels the same. It's like no time at all, though. Yeah, yeah, which is exciting. So I thought, why not put I think like my sister or best friend, which is Erin, and then Dakota, my other best friend, and we'll just kind of get them to know each other. And I feel like they get along really well, so I think we do. Oh, yeah, <laughs> just find out if you don't. Yeah, no, like get out. <laughs> like, no, no, there's like one question, it's like that's it, get out. And it's like, oh, sh- never mind. <laughs> So pretty much, I've got a ton of questions. There's 25 questions. That's good. Pretty much, you guys are just going to be answering them, talking about it. Mm. Yeah, think of it as like you know, like those BuzzFeed quizzes. It's like you know, yeah. answer these 10 questions. We'll tell you what well, kind of you are. <laughs> 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 That's the wording. <laughs> yeah. Just keeps mm. And so for the viewers, you can see that the girls also have a D20 in their hands. So. And so, oh, don't know why. <laughs> because instead of me picking, you guys are going to be rolling for which question. Uh, uh, and also because they fit it a lot, and I know they'll be like <laughs> this constantly, so I'm like, yeah. have any twine in your hand? Yeah. So, yeah. So, I'll do a couple of questions to start off with. Mm. Okay. Very simple. Uh-huh. So, we'll start very easy. What is your favorite anime? Do you want to go first? Uh uh-uh, okay, let's go first. Um, my favorite anime is Haikyuu. Do I have to explain why? Uh, yeah. Do as much as you want. Um, yeah, I've been playing volleyball for like almost 10 years now. So it's one of the things like, at first it was just kind of a joke. Like I thought I would watch it and make fun of it, but then I actually, I really loved it. Yeah. <laughs> so it was yeah. comfort anime for me. Oh, <laughs> That's awesome. Do you ever watch and you're like, oh, I want to do that move. I want to be like that. Do I feel like that? Oh, I do. And I'm yeah. like, I know I can never yeah. pull that off, but I'm going to try my best. Yeah. Do you ever like spike and just look at your hand? Like, yeah. I actually do. Oh, <laughs> I'm very short in comparison to the net that we play on. Mm-hmm. So if I get a good hit and I'm like, oh. yeah. <laughs> you do the whole like, ow. <laughs> yeah. Literally, like, and then I meet so many people that are like, oh, I started playing volleyball because of Haikyuu, and I'm like, yes. yes. <laughs> I understand. It's that. like an immediate, like, yes, exactly. you will go far. I see so many people wearing like merch to games and stuff now. I'm like, Incredible. I'm proud. Good. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Thank you for making volleyball more apparent in the culture. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Another reason. No, 100%. What's yours, Dakota? Cool. So at the moment, yeah. mine is actually no. Hang on. Mm-hmm. Oh, it's fine. Um, it's <laughs> Bungo Stray Dogs. I don't know if you've watched it. Or I not. actually have it. No. <laughs> okay, that's fine. So um, this will probably be on another video, like that anime one. Yeah. Just fine. Guy cubs. Yeah. Whenever. Yeah. Um, so Bungo Street Dogs is um, very mystery, supernatural, kind of fantasy and psychological, which is my favourite genre of anime. Mm-hmm. Um, it just, so the whole anime is very, how should I put it, I don't know, like mafia, <laughs> underground, kind of mystery solving kind of thing. Yes. Um, and every character in the anime is based off of a real life author that died. Oh, which, that's cool. Yeah, and like, like a lot of Dazai's and Chuya's. Um, like dialogue is from the books that they wrote. So cool. 
I know. So <laughs> it was like, oh, my I didn't know that. <laughs> no, so it's very interesting to like read the books about like certain characters and actually go watch the anime and see the different like connections to them. So it's probably my favorite like psychologically wise. But um, yeah, that's I probably like, mine. She's very smart. <laughs> Mm. Just mm. Oh. yeah, like, <laughs> note to self. <laughs> yeah, so I would say for Dakota, she has my animalist. Do you, are you making yours yet? I'm in the process of making it. Don't worry. Erin will have yeah. her. Cool. It will be in the description. Go check them out. But yeah, you need to make yours. Every time I'm like, I know. I yeah, yeah. <laughs> go home and I'm like, damn, I keep doing. <laughs> yeah. It's like we'll be friends on there, and we'll be like, yes. Yeah, and you can like see your comparisons between like if you watch the same ones. Yeah. The, reviews, the ratings. Yeah. Yeah. It's Very warning. I'm blunt. No. <laughs> In her life, she is with her anime. <laughs> no, okay. That's fair. I mean, it's just the same truth. Yeah, it's just the same truth. I just like the whole like sound of. Okay, next. <laughs> Moving on. <laughs> next. So we obviously well, you two just talked about your anime. Who's your anime husband or waifu? Who's your like? Who's your top oh. person? It's so two. typical of me to say Kageyama though. I know, like, oh every time I say it, I'm like, I'm gonna get judged so hard for this. Yeah. <laughs> but you know, that's who you like. Special I don't even though. like, honestly, sometimes I look at him and I'm like, why? Why do you sip the juice box so aggressively? <laughs> <laughs> Actually, yeah, I love yeah. this child. Oh, when you showed me that, I was like, that's aggressive. Yeah. He's angry. He like angst, I think. <laughs> no, see, I think for me, it's like, when a character looks angsty, but they're like a complete dumbass. <laughs> yeah, I'm like, I'm being judged so much. <laughs> I'm just like, shit, back and go. <laughs> oh, oh my god. god. Are you good? Are you good? <laughs> I think I killed her. <laughs> Are you sure? favorite husband knows. Yeah. Well obviously the one is like Dazai Osamu. He is just like my aesthetic and more. Like he's I love intelligent men. Yes Dazai is a little um suicidal but like that's, <laughs> I don't like that part. That's, that's, like, that's the spice. <laughs> yeah I'm like oh my god. <laughs> the spice I need to stop talking. He's like <laughs> You're <laughs> I don't know, he's just he's very intriguing to me. Um, my second is probably Oroki Hotaro from Hyoka. Um, he's just a very lazy 17 year old. Um, I don't know if I'm allowed to say that. No, it's fine. Um, I can't relate to that part. No, no, he's just, um, if I don't have to do it, um, then I won't. Or if uh. I have to do it, I'll do it very quickly. Um, and I'm like, okay, cool. Um, I am a sucker for brunettes, so it's like, yes, she is. I, I am like half of my favorite characters are like brunettes, and I'm like, that's mm. fair. It seems to be a trend in our group, fan, like, well, I was gonna say family groups, our friend yeah. groups. Yeah. <laughs> Sweet. And our friend groups are like, oh yeah, hair color, keep it. It's <laughs> like, you know, we got white hair, we got brown hair, yep. Caitlin's is backs. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I don't know what hair color she is. I don't know, red. I guess. Yeah. Yeah, she's I don't red. Think my favorite characters have the same hair color. Although I guess they're all basic. <laughs> <laughs> they're all like, I don't know, neutral toned? I don't know. Yeah. I'm gonna stop. Uh, yeah. <laughs> it's a fair mix, I would say. Like, if you look at all of them, it's like they don't look similar. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, mine look three of them look really similar. And I'm like, oh no. Like, okay, I realize I have a type. Like, oh, yeah, 100%. I am aware. I'm probably sure you anyway. <laughs> oh, yeah. Mm. Like, like, look at this one. I'm gonna pull up my simplest. <laughs> yes. yes. Mm. 
from the beginning. Didn't you do a PowerPoint presentation? I didn't. That was you guys. <laughs> so you better do one. Oh, well, I can if you want me yeah, to. Yeah, you can do it now. <laughs> I thought, because when we were talking about it, I thought you were going to, like, Oh, no, it. I just yeah. made a list. I, oh. I, can, I can definitely make one. <laughs> that's fair, that's fair. Yeah, we'll just make, like, a fort and just be, like, the men that are so important. Like, I'm for that. <laughs> it's like the TIG, like, category. You do, like, s Oh, yes. This man. Oh, my God. This one. one. We'll do it. Yeah, that sounds good. That'd be fun. Mm -hmm. All right, next one. Mm -hmm. This is a bit different than, like, what's your favorite? But mm -hmm. it's, what is something you knew you have tried? Either recently or just in general. What is something new? Yeah. Man, my life has been so boring. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it could be like anything mundane to me. Like, you know, I try, I don't know, painting with oil paints or like, you know, to. Oh, when anything. I tried that, it did not work. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> okay. <laughs> um, okay, I do need some time to think about this. That's fine. That's okay. <laughs> yeah. um, I would say maybe. What have I tried lately? I don't know. Um, the only thing I can really think of is like changing my style. That's the thing I've done recently, which is like, instead of looking like an Esche, um, <laughs> I, <would, laughs> I would love to look like a sophisticated adult, um, which like, I love the colors like beige and, you know, my grays and neutral tones. So it's like, I'm trying to look like a 20 year old, not a 16, let me steal your money kind of person. <laughs> oh. So I'm like, that's a very <laughs> specific aesthetic. Yeah, she doesn't look like she's out of the ghetto. She no. wants to be. <laughs> she wants to be a city girl yeah, now. She oh. yeah, she wants to live that city life. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. What about you? What have you tried? This is not nothing <laughs> the same, but like, I've been wearing sunglasses a lot. Like, I used to hate them yeah. because I used to hate having things on my face I used to have like hats like having yeah. like, bangs that kind of thing mm. but then I tried sunglasses and I was like they're actually helpful no <laughs> one people wear them they yeah. actually are beneficial to my eyes wow. and now I, I have three this. pairs I'm proud of you thank you <laughs> you after yourself that's nice <laughs> we love that and I'm not blind when we go out now yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> definitely that's nice what's your favorite drinks or like your number one thing that you order when you go out for a drink of any type. Wait. Any type. Oh. <laughs> any, any type. Whether it's like bubble tea, if it's like soft drink, if oh. it's just any drink in general. Like you're like, I've tried this once and I loved it. What is it? Aloe vera. Aloe vera drinks. Like literally any, even if it's like boba with aloe vera in it. Yeah. It is um, like, you will not see me at uni without like a bottle in my <laughs> hand. <laughs> it's so bad because we have them stocked at like the vending machines. Yeah. yeah. So yeah, every like, time. like we know she's coming. She's yeah. Coming <laughs> Very much. That's so different though. Like it, it's cool because it's like I was expecting like bubble tea or something like that. So it's like it's it's good it's to hear something of, yeah. different. <laughs> I haven't really tried one before, but I kind of do. Like, did they taste sweet or anything? Like yeah, that? they're like sweet. Like, have you had aloe vera in bubble tea before? No. Oh, okay. Well, yeah. There's like sweet, but like really refreshing. <laughs> oh, okay. That's what I like about it. I mm. think because I get hot very easily, so it kind of just reminds me of just like getting yeah. in the face <laughs> yeah. <of> wind. Yeah. <laughs> Every time I think of aloe vera, I'm like, oh yeah, for my sunburn, like, that's what I get. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's so nice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then I'm like, oh yeah, people drink that. I forget. Yeah, yeah, 100%. Oh, yeah. Mm. I think at the moment, it would probably be the Rocky Road Ice Chiller at Warrior oh, Jeans. Oh, we fancy up in here. Yeah. It's, it's, it's just really nice. <laughs> oh my god. They like put like one scoop of vanilla ice cream on top and I'm like, yes, this is that so sounds... unhealthy, but... It's amazing. It sounds very comforting. Mm. Oh, probably one of those comfort drinks you just have and you're like, yay. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Comforts. Yes. Mm. And then speaking of drinks, what's your favorite food? So it can be snacks. It can be when you're in a depressive oh, spiral. Oh, it can be, um, you know, think the number one thing you like I to eat order. so much. <laughs> well, okay, pick a cuisine you like. We'll go with that. Japanese, straight up. Yeah. Because it, like, you can't go wrong with it. It's what yeah. it's like. See, I say that though, but I don't if eat fish. <laughs> <laughs> See, I'm like, I love it, but like, I just don't eat fish. Yeah, you're like, it's yeah. great. But, but sushi? Mm, yeah. Right, Everything I, else? I love all Japan, almost all Japanese food, but any seafood you put in front of me, which is like <laughs> a big percentage of the food, is like, oh, I don't eat it. See, like, like I can eat like prawns and like squid yeah. and stuff, but just not fish. Yeah, I don't know why. I can't just eat like any seafood, and I'm like, I feel like I'm doing something wrong. <laughs> it's like I'm missing out on the whole culture. Yeah. Um, I will say fries though. Like, I will get so many cravings for fries. Like, it will just be like 1 a.m. in the morning. I'll be like, I want to go to Macca's. Yeah, but is it like, I was gonna say, is it particular fries or is it just like 
fries. Yeah. Well, it'll be like. Macca's fries are top tier. Yeah, yeah. 100%. But if we have like frozen fries in the freezer, I would just settle for those. Yeah. So you don't have like yeah. a preference on like thin or thick or nope. extra salty? Just fries. <laughs> just <laughs> potato. Yeah, literally, just <laughs> anything potato. Cut them up. And I like good. salty foods, which yeah. is kind of bad. It's so Why good would that though. be bad? Because it's terrible. <laughs> <laughs> we'll get kidney stone. Yeah, <laughs> too much sugar or too much salt. Like, just pick one. Yeah. yeah just Chuck it around, see what happens. Yeah, pretty much. I think fruit chocks. That's Ooh. that's my go-to. I love fruit chocks. They're like my comfort. They are my just everything. Yeah. I used what? to hate them. <laughs> <laughs> well, I eat them now. Like yeah. I actually quite like them. But when yeah. I was a kid, I was like, ew. <laughs> I never used to like them either. But like I used to like get really hooked on them. And then I went to Handorf and I decided to buy a kilo. <laughs> Oh my god. through it and I'm like, oh my god. Actually, oh my god, I went through a similar phase, but you know when there's like banana lollies that no one likes? Yeah. I, someone brought to school like a huge bag of those and yeah. I finished half of it by oh myself. My I was like, was it just because it was food? And you're like, I'll eat this. No, I actually mm. really like them. Oh. Do you still like them? I still like oh. them now. <laughs> yeah, like, because ev everyone hates them, they're just there, like yeah. in like a party mix. And yeah. they're all mine. Yeah, I just like them. I do. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. I think I just tried it off because yeah. Dad's like, I'll take that. I'm like, yeah. Can I try it? But like no. cherry ripe. Sorry. I love cherry ripe. Oh, I don't like cherry ripe. Oh, that's good. I love. I, no, it's not the cherry though. It's the coconut in the cherry ripe that I don't like. Mm. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> so you're not a fan of coconut? No. <laughs> <laughs> Where me, I'm like, give me all the coconuts. Yeah. I don't mm. mind coconut. It just depends what it is. Like lamingtons, I prefer not to eat just because it's so like overshone with. Coconut. coconut but if it's like just i don't know something in a cherry ripe then it's like yeah okay if it's like a little bit I yeah it's yeah. like a sprinkle yeah <laughs> sprinkle. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. that's cool all right well now that we've done kind of like the warm-up questions there's a warm-up question <laughs> no. i don't even have i feel like i talked to my we soul talk out so much <laughs> yeah. not really yeah. Yeah. that's only been 20 minutes it's not that long <laughs> i'm still hot <laughs> it should be warm yeah that's all right. okay no, it's okay mm -hmm. <laughs> Alright, so we'll start with you, Aaron. So just roll the d20 and see what number you get. Okay. Nothing's gonna kill you, it's fine. 15. Number 15. Okay. Do you think you're brave? I would like to think so. Like, if I, if someone asked me that and I had to like say that about myself, I would say yes. Mm -hmm. But I know I'm not. <laughs> like, like mentally, it, yes, physically. It, yeah, physically. It, no, yeah no. it depends no. on what it is. Like, I will try and, like, hype myself up to do things that are yeah. out of my comfort zone. But then there's sometimes I'm just like, nope, I can't do it. Like, but no. I, I, like, I like to talk myself up, but sometimes. It's yeah. good sometimes. <laughs> like, hype yourself, but then, yeah. like, yeah. What about you, Dakota? Do you think you're brave? I think certain scenarios, like... Uh, when it comes to like telling people, I guess, certain things, it's like, yeah, like whatever, I'll do it, like that's mm -hmm. fine. And like, say, I mean, roller coaster rides and stuff mm -hmm. like that, there's certain ones that I will be like, yeah, I'll do it, like, yeah, I'll just do it, like, yeah. figure it out. But then there's other ones where I was like, nah, I can't, no. Mm -hmm. So it, it kind of depends on the situation, but mm -hmm. overall, I would say, yeah, I think I am. Like, yeah, yeah. Like more so with like verbal things. Is yeah, what you're yeah, no. Like yeah. physical stuff, I'm like, Whoa. Yeah. but like if it yeah. comes to like confronting people or like telling yeah. the truth and stuff and like mm. being blunt, yeah, I, like think we're on the same page. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Like so I'll just do it. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's like you're being a bitch. Shut up. Yeah. <laughs> I am not that. I'm like non-confrontational. Yeah. I will take it all on. <laughs> Woo. Anyway, I rolled the card. <laughs> oh, okay, cool. Ah, uh, ten. Ten. Okay. What? Oh, sorry. When was the last time you completely lost yourself in something? Oh, you can boy. say what it was, when it was, whatever. Uh, I would say there's like two scenarios. Maybe, um, maybe a few weeks ago where I was generally like, I was watching anime and I was going through my anime list and I would just got really like into different animes and like different topics and then really figuring out I really like this, I really don't like this, and just deconstructing everything because mm -hmm. I love deconstructing anime because it's just like, yes, like all the details and just mm, kind of stuff. <laughs> <laughs> like, <laughs> like, <laughs> yes. <laughs> um, and then it's probably just drawing. Mm -hmm. Like, I hate not getting like drawings right because I'm a bit of a perfectionist in that sense, but lately it's been like small drawings and I've been really lost in like, say, the D&D &D artwork I've been doing. I actually mm -hmm. love doing that, so. 
That's cute. Yeah, that's probably what I've been lost in at the moment. So. I love that. What mm -hmm. about you? I actually, I thought of two things. Mm -hmm. One was like the other day I went over to a friend's house and we were doing like those like, you know, paint by numbers, but instead of like paint, it's like the diamond studs. Oh, yes. yes. We did that for ages and she was like talking to me. She, we were watching a movie or whatever. I was just sitting there. <laughs> <doing Yes>. <laughs> <laughs> let me do my diamond painting. <laughs> Literally, I was just so lost in doing it. I forgot that she was there. Yeah. <laughs> Which sounds so terrible, yeah. but like it's been so long because I really like paint by numbers. Mm. Yeah, yeah. So it's like something you don't have to think about, but you're mm. still creating, like yeah. that kind of thing. The other, <laughs> this is going to sound actually worse than the other thing, but like driving. The other day, I was like literally just driving to work and I felt like I was falling asleep. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Next <laughs> time, <laughs> hold me. <laughs> no, like it, in a way that was like I was just feeling so calm. Not like yeah. I was tired or anything, yeah. but it was just like driving by myself with my music on. Like, yeah. yeah. That always gets me. Mm, I, I just got lost in it. Yeah. I did that the other day, but I think it was pretty dangerous. <laughs> yeah, no, I like as soon as I like snapped out of it, I was like, oh shit, how did I get here? <laughs> yeah. Like a hundred percent, like when I was driving a little bit like after work, it was like a late night or something like that. I just had my music blasting, stuff like that. And I just put my arms out like this. And I'm like, this is just really like, I don't know. I just had a weird yeah. moment. I'm like, yes, I'm like, Dakota. You're meant to be driving. <laughs> <laughs> you're meant to be driving. <laughs> okay, cool. Oh God, I'm going to lose my license. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy. I was, dri I was driving normally, but my hands were just like, yeah, just cool. like let's <laughs> <laughs> just flutter. Why not? I'm like, let's just fly away now. Yeah. <laughs> so get home first. Mm. Be safe and then, and then just wee. starfish. You know? Yeah, and then you can be free. <laughs> oh. Then yeah, okay. yeah, go. It's fifteen again. We're rolling in. <laughs> yeah. It's fourteen. <laughs> <laughs> you go. Okay. What was the last lie you told, or the worst lie you have told? Mm, okay. See, the thing with this question is, I absolutely hate lying. Mm -hmm. So I like if it's a serious lie, like I straight up can't do it. Yeah. But like, uh, <laughs> you're like, well, hold on, let me think about it. Yeah. I don't know. It could be something even as simple as like a white lie. Yeah. Doesn't have See, to be. I, like I barely do those either. <laughs> like I just don't like lying in general. Although there was this one time, mm -hmm. I think day. Oh no, day. Yeah. Okay. It was actually to my ex because we were in this group chat and one of my friends hit the group chat up saying like, hey, we should all hang out, but my ex was still in that group. Oh. Ah, yes. And so I had like, they deleted the conversation when we were like explained to them what happened. Yeah. But then my ex hit me up and was like, hey, why did this person message that chat? We haven't even talked in it in a while. And I was like, oh, you know, just like she sent it to the wrong chat or whatever. But then like, I don't know, like, cause I was saying like, I hate lying. Like that made me feel so terrible. Yeah. So I, <laughs> I hit them up later that night. I was like, sorry, that was a lie. Like, here's what actually happened. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, okay, you're kidding me. This is yeah. what happened, but. <laughs> yeah, no, like it wasn't too big of a deal, but like it just made me feel gross. So mm. yeah. I had to explain myself, even though she was like, oh, it's not that big a deal. You could have just told me the truth. It's like, I'm aware of that. Mm. But like, I, mm, I felt awkward doing that. Yeah. 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 Mm. I understand. Fair enough. <laughs> <laughs> I, don't, not my I, don't, I don't know. Ugh, this is like stupid. It's not stupid, but like oh. I was kind of like, I had to go along with the lie that I told. Uh, but it, it was. A mistake. So back in year 12, when I was doing my research, for, I don't know if I told you this, um, but so what happened was I had a massive breakdown because obviously research project, everything was like yeah. going crazy. And I had a fight with one of my uh, mates and we were no longer friends. So when I was talking to my teacher about it, I said, I lost my friend. And she took it as in she died. Oh, oh my god! god. <laughs> 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 so I went to the toilet and the teacher told the whole class Dakota is having a really bad day. Her friend has died. <laughs> and I, oh my god! I went back to the classroom and my friend was like, Dakota, um, the teachers told the entire class that your mates died. And I'm like, well, it's, it's too late to kind of back out now. <laughs> I would be like, actually. <laughs> so I had to just go with it. And I'm like, oh, no. Jesus. <laughs> and I 
and I'm like, people came up to me and was like, are you okay? And this looks so bad because I, are you okay? And I'm like, no, I'm good. <laughs> like, I'm great. Don't like, worry about it. it was, like, <laughs> didn't actually happen. Like my friend is alive. She's well. <laughs> I'm like, I didn't even know what to do. I'm like, do, do I tell her? Like, what do I do? And my hair like, is, would it sound bad if you said, oh, no, nah, she is alive. You just like misunderstood. And I'm like, Sorry, yeah, yeah, this, especially because it's like a teach too. You don't want to be yeah, like, You're wrong. Yeah, you know. And she told the entire class, so it's like, well, holy shit! Like, yeah. maybe. Why would you tell the whole class anyway? Like, I get. Yeah, like, right. Like, yeah. Just, like, <laughs> like, say something she's like going through some stuff. Don't tell her a friend died. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. She's like, oh yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah. She happened. was the gossy te- gossip uh, teacher though. Uh, she loved to like act like the like she was more of the kid. Yeah, yeah, exactly. And I'm like, so to this day, she still thinks my friend is dead. Oh my god. So yeah. like, like, that, that was probably the worst light I've had to go with. Yeah. Not even like oh, not even your own light. It was just like a <laughs> misunderstanding. <laughs> and I'm like, okay, cool. Like, mm-hmm. like all right, that happened. I did the thing. Yeah. <laughs> Could you imagine though? Like you have a reunion. It's like, oh yeah, I, I, I think you're still doing okay from your lost friends. Like actually. They're alive. Yeah, I would love to go back now and be like, um, that they didn't, didn't die. <laughs> that didn't <laughs> that didn't what twist? That's so oh my god. I kind of wish I worded it better, but I was hoping she <laughs> didn't. <laughs> I was just like, I was like, okay, maybe the teacher's gonna be like, oh, you know, is missing. Not then. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> she jumped so far. No <laughs> question. <laughs> nothing. She's like, she jumped so far, and I'm like, okay, cool. <laughs> I'm stuck with this now. Now I look like a cold bitch because I'm like, yeah, I'm fine. Like, yeah. <laughs> like, she's gone. It's like, oh no, she's fine. She's fine. But yeah, that, that's probably my worst experience with lies, I guess. I feel weird. Yeah. Like, mm-hmm. You feel like that. Good to know if any of us, you know, not be friends with friends, she's dead. She's dead to me and everyone else. Like, okay. She would just accept it. Moving on. Yeah. But like, next person. You're proud of yourself, son. Are <laughs> you talking about my uh, how my friend apparently died? Is it? <laughs> <laughs> pretty hot. Hey, I'll pick the numbers, not me. Yeah, true. Oh, okay. Like in this situation right now, or like, yeah, like overall. Let's say like overall, like leading up to it. Are you proud? <laughs> I'm sorry, my phone. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'm old. I, I, I flinch <laughs> every time it happens. Like I'm aware that it just it's your bones. When you hit twenty. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> It's this year. <laughs> yeah, so when you're 20, I'll be 21, you'll hear more of my bones about you. <laughs> I heard okay. us in the kitchen before, we were both on our tippy toes and we both had like the cracking ankles. So, yeah. <laughs> it's like all you heard was <laughs> yeah. down. It was so bad. So funny. Think of it as this. Are you proud of all the things you've done up to now? Are you proud of your life so far? I would say so. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, obviously there's like some things that I'm like, Ooh, but you know. Um, in general, I'm proud of where I am. Yeah. I'm proud of you. Aww. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I, I'd say I'm proud. Like, I've come through a lot, so it's like, yeah, I can say I'm proud of myself. Like, so you should be, yeah. I'm proud yeah, of you. I'm very proud of you. Yeah. Yes. With this wholesome group right here. No. Oh. no, like, I know you both well I'm, I'm, I was gonna say quiet but I'm like yeah 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 I don't know why I second guess it yeah. <laughs> I, don't know. I think I don't know like, I don't want to say quiet well people are like why oh, secret it's like shut up you what? literally okay <laughs> I'm not gonna get into how much you know about me we all have secrets I still like, learn many things whenever I go to your parties I hear things and I'm like when did this oh, like, what? Pardon? Because that like, probably stuff I didn't want you to tell. <laughs> yeah. I am that friend that's like, excuse me, when did this happen? Pardon? I was like, oh, just like, shit. <laughs> yeah, and like, uh, her other friends will say, it's like, shut up. She's yeah. here, and I'm like, what? <laughs> yeah. But no, like, I'm proud of both of you. You both have, like, achieved a lot in your lives. Like, obviously, again, knowing you are in the longest, I know all the different things from, like, primary school to now. And, I know all the things you've done and seeing all like your artwork progression and stuff like that is just oh. 
They're always making me really happy. Yes. Yes. I like constantly come home, I'm like, what's okay, Aiden? <laughs> Say my little, I don't know why, I'm like, I treat you like a little sister, but sometimes I'm like, have that proud daughter mode. Where I'm like, <laughs> my yeah. god is doing so well. Like, when you were my graduation. Like, <laughs> literally, I that was literally, <laughs> I was at a graduation, I'm like, oh <laughs> I was sitting next to our friend Bianca and I looked at her and I literally just went, we did well, huh? She's like, yeah, we did. Oh my god. But like, we raised a good kid. That's <laughs> and her mom was just like, yeah, you did. <laughs> I was like, you raised a good kid too. Uh-huh. She's like, you all. I, I raised you like all well. well. <laughs> <laughs> like, oh my god. It was so weird. I literally was like, because I at her 18th, I started crying. I was like, aww. There's like a video of me like crying my eyes. I'm like, give me a second. Because I had the microphone and everything. I was like, because <laughs> yeah. oh I went in the song and feel like, you know, I'm so proud of you, all these things, and I was like, I was like doing the whole like shit yeah, yeah, I was like, yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. Oh, that's so I was like, that's not that's right, whatever. But <laughs> basically, mm-hmm. I did the whole like crying thing, my friend being like, what, do you want do you want me to take over for a second? I'm like, please, I need to cry. And I'm like, okay. And so she just took over and I'm like, thank you. And I'm still like crying my eyes oh, now. And I'm like, yeah, but you know, it's fine. Oh, and like I'm still really kind of like a big show. I'm like, there you go. Yeah. 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 for it. I don't like even though like the three years I've known you, like I can just see how much you grow. It's insane. Like even like when I talk to mum about it, because oh. tea. Every time <laughs> mum's always like, yeah, I can see Dakota has grown so much. She used to be really shy coming here, and like yeah. kind of. You still do the same thing where like as yeah. soon as you get up from somewhere, if there's a blanket next to you, you use it. You have to like fold up and be like, I'm a good kid. Yeah. Like, but like I can see you relax more and you're happier. And, yeah. That's cute. You know, I'm like in the fridge door by myself today. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> actually, I'm so anxious doing that. <laughs> I kind of looked at Jada and I'm like, no. <laughs> this takes so? Yeah. I saw you and I'm like, I'm, I'm just, just like, like, open. It's like, coke. It's like, I can grab it myself. Oh my oh god. god. But, do you remember Halloween? How, like, um, Melanie wanted nuggets, right? Oh no. And so I had to walk into the house and be like, Joey, can you make the nuggets now? <laughs> I felt so awkward. Mom would not let me down for that. She's like, see? I told you I'm better okay with you. I'm like, I forgot the chicken nuggets. I'm <laughs> sorry. I forgot a bunch of 20 year olds want chicken nuggets. <laughs> I'm sorry. And she's like, yeah, this is why you should have chicken nuggets. I'm like, okay. I'll do it when all your friends are drunk. I'll have chicken nuggets for you. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm like, God damn it. All right. What was your first impressions of each other? Well, I think I. Oh, sorry. <laughs> No, you go. <laughs> yeah, that's right. I think I just like when I first met you, I kind of just said it out loud, anyway. Yeah, <laughs> yeah like, no, 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 like, well, this is um, pretty much our first like kind of proper impression and stuff like that. I just said like you look like a talented person. Oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> and I'm like, that thing she said like, literally like yeah, yeah. two yeah. hours ago. <laughs> now that sounds good. I th- I don't know. I thought like just from hearing and stuff like that. It's like you're very like outgoing and very fun and I'm like, okay, that's good. And I'm like, oh, she smiles a lot, that's good. And I'm like, yeah. she's happy. Yeah, yeah, but like, I just laugh when I'm nervous. Yeah. <laughs> I just nervous a lot. Yeah. I don't know, but like, I'm thinking like back to Halloween because we didn't talk when you first arrived. Yeah. But I, Halloween. no, not Halloween, Um, your birthday, birthday. sorry. Yeah. But I remember being like, I really want to talk to her, she looks oh. cool. <laughs> I told you, you're cool. Oh, hey. Yeah, and yeah. that was like, the first idea I had with you, and I was like, yeah. I know, I was like <laughs> trying to figure out how to interact. And yeah, then, like, literally, and then we just started talking about anime, and I was like, oh, Yeah, cool. yeah, and then like the whole, um, the wings and the harness. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm like, this is weird. Caitlin, this, this isn't what I want. Like, <laughs> <laughs> Is this a good first impression? <laughs> like, hello, people I've never met. Oh, yeah, Harness. Nice to meet you. Yeah, yeah. I'm very glad I brought it. <laughs> yeah, that was an interesting thing. It worked well, though. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I'm glad. Yeah. <laughs> kind of going off of that, what's, mm. what embarrasses you the most in front of other people? Could be something you do or, or like a nervous thing, whatever it is. I think it's like the rambling thing. I do it because a lot of my friends are quite silent people yeah so then I've gotten used to just like talking (laughs) whenever it like goes quiet and I'll do that a lot with strangers but then I'll overshare things too Uh, much (laughs) so I was like they don't know me that well I shouldn't be telling them that yeah they don't need to know every detail about me exactly and I'm like oh probably shouldn't have said that Mm -hmm. so yeah sometimes like I'll realize after and be like that was a bit embarrassing (laughs) 
hate that moment. Yeah. Um, I probably have two. <laughs> One is, well, I used to say whenever it went quiet and was awkward, I'd be like, well, this is awkward. <laughs> like, oh, and I, I literally <laughs> was that person and then I would like get people talking. I would be the one to be like, well, this is awkward. What do you do? Kind of thing. Yeah. Like, yeah. But I don't do that anymore because it's awkward. Like really, 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 really awkward. awkward. <laughs> it's really awkward. Um, but my main thing is probably breaking things. I break so much she stuff. Does. She breaks a lot of things. Um, last thing I broke was like we walked into a Korean barbecue place and I broke their stairs. <laughs> <laughs> they had like a little like, I don't, I don't even, like a little, I was going to say driveway, you know what, that's funny, that's funny. Um, Almost like a little guard on the stairs just so like you wouldn't oh, slip. Okay, yeah. And she stepped on it and went, <laughs> and made the biggest noise. And everyone just looked and we were all like, it was so bad. What a Dakota And I, I broke so much and I'm like, I'm just, yeah. Damn. Stay still. Like, <laughs> just like, don't move. Like, you hit people with your shoulders and you're like, I'm sorry. Yeah, it happens, but yeah. that, that's probably it. Like, I just body. Yeah, yeah. It's like, I'm <laughs> sorry. It's like, I can't, <laughs> I can't do anything. Yeah. That's, that's probably it for me. Like, what the existing? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, so difficult. Okay. Mm. So, what emotion do you experience the most? That can be from your entire lifetime or like in the last year or so hmm. yeah what what feelings do y'all have other than just you want someone to love you oh <laughs> um, <laughs> yeah that's okay well that's basically <laughs> yeah. like what well, yeah. um mm. paranoia probably that's what i feel a lot um i don't know like um because i'm so used to being on the go yeah I, I have to keep busy, mm. but at the same time, it's like, I, like, I don't know, see, I'm, I'm lost now, <laughs> like, oh no, I think it's just like, on the go, Yeah. I don't know if you can call that like an emotion, other than like, yes, it's kind of like paranoia, but it's like, you the have urge to, to like, stuff, yeah. yeah, like just to keep going, yeah, to have the adrenaline going, mm. things like that, yeah, well, that makes sense. Something. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, like in all seriousness, like the past year or so, I've been trying to be more happy with myself. Mm. So like just the little things, like oh you did this, like I'm proud of you, yeah. <laughs> like that kind of thing. And I like try, like the past year I've been really impulsive with a lot of things, and while that hurts my bank account, <laughs> yeah, it, yeah, it actually like it makes me happier to be like oh I can make this decision and that's okay. Yeah. You know? mm. Like I don't know. I'm just more so than most of my life. Yeah. <laughs> That's good. Questionable. Yeah. Happy is good. Yeah. yeah. I was like, but pleasantly what? surprised. Yeah. <laughs> you know what? That is fair. I'll take yeah. that. Sounds good. Okay, so we talked about before about what we didn't like about ourselves. So what is something you do love about yourself? It could be anything in particular. Mm. I'm stubborn. Yeah. In a good way though. Like <laughs> no, no, <laughs> not as in like not as in like, you know, I'm stubborn like, oh my god, like you know, I'm not a bitch. I'm not Yeah. That, like it's more of if I have a goal, I will not break it. I am like a very determined You're person. driven. Yeah, yeah. Very stubborn in that way. And I'm just like mm. it's like, no, I will do it. Mm. It's like if people's like no, you, you you can't do this. Like, no, I will do it. Like, yeah. watch me do it. <laughs> like, you watch me succeed. I will do it. Yeah, exactly. I think that's probably one of the things that I really like about myself. It's like, don't tell me I can't do it because watch me do it. Like, yeah. Like, that's good though. Yeah. It's a good nice. trait to have. Yeah. 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 I definitely like motivation. So yeah. <laughs> yeah. I admire that. You're both yeah. being young. I'm realizing we're both young. Like, you have a lot of yeah. similar things, but you're both just like, kind of like, like the opposites. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, what's well? What's good? What do you love? I mean, okay. Mm -hmm. I know I was just complaining about how embarrassing <laughs> it is, but I actually do like that I ramble on. Like, it is quite embarrassing in the moment, but it makes most people really comfortable enough yeah. to like talk to me, even if they're complete strangers. And I don't yeah. know. I feel like that, that makes me happy. <laughs> yeah. And I like I do like that I'm like I just talk. I'm. A, I'm it sounds so vain, but like, <laughs> I feel like I am a good conversationalist, so mm. yeah, I do like that about myself. You're yeah. very like comfortable to talk to. You're yeah. very welcoming in that kind of sense. Like I feel like I can tell you a lot. Oh, thanks. Like, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Nice. 
I definitely agree with on that. I never feel like, for example, you. I love your honesty degree. Like, I just love how, yeah. you know, we can have a conversation and just like, nah, I'm just, I'm telling you exactly how I feel. This is my emotions. This is, like, yeah. it might not be, like, fullest honesty or whatever, but, like, yeah. I know, like, what you're saying, I'm more likely to trust versus something else. Or you're willing to also just tell me, both of you do this, actually. You both are willing to tell me when I do something shit. Yeah. And you both are just willing to, like, Jada. Mm. No. being a shithead <laughs> shut up yeah you know focus mm. do this like i really appreciate that in both of you mm. and then with you erin i just oh god there's a lot that was <laughs> yeah. like here we go nah mm. i feel like this is just like jada compliments everyone for <laughs> three hours for like three hours yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no mm. but like i think one of the things i particularly love about you erin is just how you've always been like, you always show yourself self in the expression and the things you do and just even like something as simple as like from the way you draw to how you dress and the way you chat with people like all of your different friends you've had are similar in some aspects but all so different and i think it works really well because you can see like how much you've grown and changed and woo look at that go we touched on this briefly so mm. we'll talk about it anyway but has it been a particular person or object or book, whatever it might be, that's influenced your life the most? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 No. <laughs> okay, that's a <laughs> So we can't say you. I mean, you can if you want, but if you can, no, this sounds really like, bad. How much but more can you <laughs> like, <laughs> go? No. Mm -hmm. But like, if you are going to me, then you could say something else if you wanted to. You want to do something? <laughs> or it's like, I need a thing. I think there's been like a few things I guess like probably the first thing is like my tattoo my, my Japanese tattoo um which is it says let's promise in Japanese which is um something I promised to myself like look after yourself make sure you're doing the right thing for you yeah. yes I forget about it sometimes but like it's always there and no matter how many times I forget it's there it's like still in my head being like no you can push yourself you can keep going and i think that's like a motivation that i've really found like with this tattoo and it's just like yes like i love it so much um probably the other thing is like probably one of the youtubers i watch which is peter mckinnon yeah, <laughs> I knew it was gonna come yeah like um he's a filmmaker and he just he has this kind of like um i don't know content that really like motivates me to just do better and he's got this whole um mentality of just like do it just create you are a creative person and just do it yeah and i'm like yes i can do it like let's go like, kind cool. of thing yeah, so yeah. those two are probably like my big two yeah oh, that's good yeah i hear you talk about a lot of that theater i'm like Oh. Yeah, <laughs> he's awesome. That's cool. Like even like when it comes to like our uni work, because if you don't know, uh, Dakota and I do bachelor media design, and like we'll be talking about like film stuff, or mm. and you'd be like, I just watched like Peter did this, and it was yeah. really good. <laughs> yeah. I'm like, oh, yeah. yeah, this and that. And I'm like, it's good. It's good to have those people who are very like influential to you. Definitely. I think works well. Mm. See, I've been trying to come up with yeah. different ideas, <laughs> and it literally is just like you and Bianca are like all of my friends because yeah. like it's different from like Dakota because hers is like career wise whereas yeah. I don't have that kind of goal in mind I kind of just yeah. want to get through uni yeah. You know? yeah, yeah. so it's like nothing's really like inspirational for me in that mm. sense whereas like my friends always push me to be better and like I want to improve for them mm -hmm. as well yeah. so I'm not like I don't know how to explain <laughs> it <laughs> yeah, that's, that's fair like, it's like so yeah then at least we can all grow together if that makes sense because we don't yeah. want to be like the worst version of ourselves and then like having people around to point out stuff if i can't see it that really helps me mm. and then yeah help me become a better person <laughs> yeah. i think that works well like that heaps yeah. Yeah. if you could live anywhere in the entire world where would Ooh. it be for only a year that you can only live there as if we couldn't go back now. So you could go back for like holidays, but okay. you can't live there. Okay. You've said that. Because otherwise that would be very tragic. Um, so you can pick any place or if it's a particular city, whatever, it doesn't matter. I'm going to be cliche, but probably Japan, Tokyo. Yeah. 
I was. <laughs> I was expecting that answer. Yeah, like, like, what? You can do everything there. Where, whether it's your hobbies, your career, or just anything is like making it like anything's to wow everything just like the new slogan for wow. i just saw this <laughs> sentence in my brain just go <laughs> i felt like that was like oh wow new japanese thing anything is possible <laughs> <laughs> anything is possible in japan i was trying so hard to get it out fast and i was just like Depossible. <laughs> we get it yeah it's like yeah, Japan. That that's for me. Yeah. Honestly, I think my answer is probably the same. If not Japan, though, it would probably be somewhere in Italy. I don't know why. I know you're gonna hate this answer because you actually, because you always. What do you mean? Because I always. <laughs> yeah. You always shit on like Italian. <laughs> Why? <laughs> because Vado is Italy from Italy for people who don't know you. Oh, human journey. Anyway, you and your family are just like, hmm. <laughs> I mean. Yeah. Well, I just like, I know this is terrible, but like, I like the aesthetic of yeah. Italy, especially yeah. like, I don't know, just the way that it, yeah, it vibes. I guess. Yeah. <laughs> and like, I don't know, like, I wouldn't want to live there permanently. That's why this was like, the, yeah. what I thought of. Yeah. Like, yeah. Mm. Whereas with Japan, like, I can kind of see me living there for, like, a long time. Mm. Yeah. See, I was, like, tossing between Melbourne and Japan. So mm. it's like, I would love... But you would live in, J- uh, in Melbourne, sorry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it's mm. like, I would visit Japan all the time, mm. but I would probably end up with Melbourne. Definitely. Yeah. Would you, like, alternate between the two and, like, living? <laughs> if you probably had, like, like let's say you had all the money, on, would you? Would I, I don't know. You have a holiday home in Japan. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> If I had the money, I would yeah. probably live in Japan permanently. Okay. Just like, why not? The, uh, my only issue is with living in Japan is that the work ethic is so different there. Yeah. Like, I don't know if I could handle that. Like, even now, like, we are a very chill yeah. Like, yeah. Little <laughs> country with our standards yeah. and work oh, yeah. ethic. It's like, I don't know if I could keep up yeah, with that like, as much as I yeah. want to. Like, 100 hours a week, like, that's insane. Mm-hmm. And I'm like... Yeah, like I think I work really hard, but like <laughs> it's like yeah, maybe like eight hours sitting, and then that's it for me. And they're then... like, huh, that's a holiday. Yeah, <laughs> I know. It's like, oh, oh their work ethic is insane. Yeah, it's so tiring. Impressive yeah. though. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Oh my god. Okay, back to your little childhood. I don't know why I said like that, but I did anyway. Mm. Um, when you were little, what did you want to be when you were older? So it can be career-wise, it can be like, personally, it could be whatever you wanted to be. And it could be basic, it doesn't matter. <laughs> My parents always make fun of me for this, but I always used to say I wanted to be a hairdresser. <laughs> <laughs> Which is like not your typical like kid answer. Yeah, like, but I think I like the idea of being able to help people like express themselves mm-hmm. through like how they look. Yeah. And I also just like braiding people's hair. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I imagine you'd be like, like as a kid, braiding like, specialist. Yeah. Honestly, I felt so proud of myself when some girl came up to me and was like, Can you braid my hair today? I was like, Yes, absolutely. I'll schedule you in. <laughs> you should be available. 100%. Um, I don't know, to be honest. Like, I don't think I had a a um, career choice when I was like younger, younger, but when yeah. I got into primary school, it was an artist like that was the first thing like either a tattoo artist or just an artist i wasn't that fast because i started doing commissions when i was like 10. yeah so i've been doing it for a very very long time so it's kind of just yeah, you've been doing it for almost a decade now yeah it's literally be a decade this year yeah that's that's <laughs> freaky that's exciting. Mm, yeah. yeah that's very exciting. when you put it like that it is kind yeah of like that, i've been into art ever since i was like True. Mm. So it's always been a thing for me. That's so cool. You talented house. <laughs> what is something you fear about when you get older? Just anything. Wrinkles. <laughs> <laughs> On that pretty face of yours, I would be worried too. <laughs> I don't know. Like specifically as you're getting older, I feel like it would be like losing touch with people, if that makes sense. Because yeah. like, I know a lot of 
people like even in their twenties, like they don't have like as close of like like late twenties. I mean, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 small. No, 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 no. I'm already like, yeah, I'm, I I get this yeah, already. Yeah, I'm like, yeah, yeah, I'm fully aware of this. I'm like, yeah, mm. experiences now. They have already like <laughs> lost touch with a lot of their like close friends that they were you like used to be really yeah close with. Yeah, obviously. <laughs> but, yeah, yeah. No, I, I guess you. Yeah, but yeah, I don't know, something like that probably. Mm. Yeah. But also wrinkles. <laughs> yeah, wrinkles get me. I think it's um, um, accepting that I can't, um, what is it, like keep the pace physically. Because obviously mm. when you get older, you get more frail, you get more out of breath, easy, yeah. you run out of energy. Me being anemic now, like, you know, like I think that's going to get in the way a lot mm. and I won't accept it until it kind of it really impacts bad. me which yeah. is what I'm I think is what I'm worried about the most but at the same time it's like why well, can take my time like yeah. if I really like why rush at that age but yeah I think that's just probably it being frail I'm like mm. yeah I mean it is definitely scary just being like yeah you're growing up mm. like oh god things are happening without my control Ugh. Yeah. Woo, how fun. Speaking of <laughs> getting old, what would you like to eat if you had your last meal? Like, what would your last meal be? It could be anything. Oof. Let's say you had no, like, spending limit. It was just whatever you want, no matter how expensive. I can choose several things. Meal. So you can do like a three course meal if you wanted to. Oh, it's be and I think it's snack. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> whatever you want it to be. <laughs> I was actually going to say like beef jerky or something. Yeah, you, can, you can do that. I'm yeah. just saying like, because I know Aaron's yeah. like, yeah, yeah, I want 700 different things. <laughs> but if you wanted to, you could be like, okay, I'll have this as main, this as entree. Yeah. You know what oh. I mean? Oh. Okay. Okay, like really thinking about it. Um. Sound beef jerky, not gonna lie. <laughs> not gonna lie. Have that beef jerky. Yeah, like beef jerky and some sarsaparilla. Yeah. That, that's a weird combo, but it, yeah, it worked for me. So, hey, it's what you like, so yeah. might as well. Mm-hmm. That's fair. I've been really craving katsudon lately. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. so, I think I'm gonna go with that. I was waiting for the back of fries. That's it. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Just, Entree. <laughs> yeah. My entree is mac and fries. Right. That's it. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, they can be your sides if oh, you want them. Cuts it on. Oh my god. So exposed. Oh. It's funny, guys, because when you said that, I'm like, ramen. Oh, oh ramen. Yeah. I'm like, oh, I like dumb body. And I'm like, no. You just, no. You just start thinking of all the new I'm hungry now. <laughs> I'm like, oh, no, no. no. Not I'm good. Like, my goodness. Good. Eat more. No. What's a dream you've never said out loud? My voice was like, <laughs> I mean, personally, I love the concept of dreams. Like, I, you've seen my dream book, right? It's like yes. a dream dictionary. So I yeah. always, like, look up what it all means and I'll tell everyone like, oh, what yeah, happened. Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah, I don't think there's ever been a dream that I've just kept to myself. <laughs> yeah. It's to be like, uh, you know, I fell asleep. Had a dream. Uh-huh, like, like, you like, like a dream. <laughs> okay. I was like, oh, okay. <laughs> you can do either or. Like, 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 my yeah. dream journal. <laughs> I mean, like, yeah. 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 It could just be, you know, when I was, like, for me, for example, which I've told you guys more recently, but, you know, when I was younger, I dreamed that I would be living with, like, my friend Erin and Bianca. Like, we'd be living together, mm. you know, we'd Oh, just... that, yeah. <laughs> Why are you laughing? <laughs> Bitch, no, 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 it just clicked, well, like, what kind of dream? <laughs> yeah, see, that's why I was confused. <laughs> we literally did the opposite. I was like, wait, what? Like, wait, crew dreams or like dreams? So when you dreams, said that, I'm like, yeah, yeah like yeah. sleeping dreams, and then you <laughs> to dreams. I'm like, fuck. Oh my God. <laughs> Please continue. Yeah, basically, my yeah. dream when I was like, I think it was like eight. I was like, yeah, I'm gonna move in with like Aaron and Bacon when we're older. We're gonna have a great house. We'll have cats running around. I'm like, yeah. where look at us go? And then we'll probably be seeing each other. But right now, I'm like, yay, we'll live together. But like, that was my dream as a kid. But I'd always kept that quiet until recently. So yeah. I was like, Aaron. Tell you. It'll happen eventually. Mm-hmm. That's right. mm-hmm. Okay, well, going by that. <laughs> yeah. yeah. You can say whatever you want, whatever you classify as a dream. Mm. I mean, I have told people this, but not enough for it to be like something that I actually consider. But yeah. like, yeah. 
I've always like kind of wanted to get into modeling, like just like clothes modeling, not like modeling modeling, yeah. but like the co- like because I really like. Sounds so narcissistic. <laughs> <laughs> I, like I really I, I like have like being in photos yeah. and stuff like that. I used to hate it. I was absolutely like, grossed out by the idea of it. But if I mm. like like I like the idea of like a choreographed kind of like photo shoot yeah, kind of yeah. thing yeah, yeah. so those make me happy like if i could just live off of doing like modeling plus size modeling like clothing yeah. whatever like i would really adore that yeah yeah i think you'd rock that too <laughs> stop <laughs> playing the <laughs> yeah do it mm. what's stopping you <laughs> <laughs> so many things like i said we'll start an early trend let's go <laughs> i'm believe. so tempted <laughs> I mean, we got the lighting, all this stuff. I'll be like, all right, here's the lights. I will turn the camera and just walk out. Bye. <laughs> like, I mean, it could just be normal photos. It doesn't have to be. But okay, okay. Sorry. Right. <laughs> um, dr- dream. Yeah. Um, I don't really know. Oh my god, I just thought of my freaking zoo. Mm. What? Like the career pathway when I was a kid. Oh yeah. Uh, I used to want to be a fucking zoologist. Sorry, for my mom. Sorry. I I didn't even like think about it because I was like so immersed because like art was just pretty much in there. But like, I bought animal books. I bought like I was so invested in animal behavior. Yeah. And I loved it. I used to have like this massive book, and I used to steal my grandma's like freaking files of like all these animal <laughs> stuff. And I'm like, I want to be a zoologist. And I'm like, I want to work in a zoo. I used to want to be that. Um, and it was funny because um, one of my parents was like, oh, you should be like a face painter at the zoo. And then I think that artistic thing kind of just like took over. What a way to like transition from like yeah. paint, 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 right? yeah, yeah. painting faces <laughs> to draw faces. Yeah, I know. I'm like, okay. But yeah, I think my dream <laughs> was um, to move out with one of my best friends. When we were younger, we used to like look up houses, write down like 20 of them and be like, this is how it's going to be. Mm-hmm. We're going to do this. We're going to shop like this. And it, it was just really funny. Yeah. So. <laughs> Look at us. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Okay. yeah that's, I think that's cool though. Mm. Go. What is one thing you regret having done or not done in your life so far? Because we're still young. <laughs> mm-hmm. Oh no. <laughs> I see the laugh on shoulders. I'm like, oh no. You can go first. <laughs> yeah, it's like, I got a good old story time. So I'm just checking the battery. Right. Um, oh, what, like, sort of what we have, wish we did. So, yeah, yeah. what's something you have regret done, regret, like, doing, or yeah. not, even if you regret not doing it? Um, probably... See if I... Mm-hmm. I want to say travel, but that's not my fault. <laughs> like, mm. obviously, yeah. you can't do that. Um, but probably, <laughs> yes, the usual. Um, <laughs> probably speak up. When I was young, I didn't speak up at all. Mm-hmm. And I regret not doing that earlier because I feel like it would have changed my life a lot more if I just said something. Even if it was like one word, it would have changed my entire experience. Um, but yeah, that was that was probably what I regret the most. So. Yeah. Oh well, man, mine was just gonna be dating that one guy. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Honestly, mm-hmm. they don't need to know the story behind. That. Yeah, no, that's, that's <laughs> fair. He was dumb. That's all I'm gonna say. Oh, he was pathetic. <laughs> he was. This is mid. He's not even mid. He's worse than mid. <laughs> hey, it's, it's what lust does to you. Oh yeah. I'm just you didn't date at the time. <laughs> I mean, it didn't last long. No, it did not. Thank God. They all blend in one eventually. <laughs> like time. <laughs> 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 my guy. I wow. the time. My whole dating history has just been crushed. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. Then uh, I meant times. Mm. Times are very much a blur lately. Not. Mm. Okay. Anyway, last question. Right. Which I feel like. For you, it was going to be very recent, but when was the last time you cried? Actually, <laughs> yeah. it's kind of... Wait. Yeah. Mm-hmm. It really wasn't 
It was when I messaged you that one time and all the girls were over. <laughs> Do you remember that? Yes. You remember and I was like, it really yeah. wasn't a big deal, but I was just in my field wow. and also PMS. Yeah, it was, yeah. Uh, it was so funny. So for like a little bit of context, uh, her and I, as well as our friend Kaylin and Alyssa, we were filming a D&D video, which is <laughs> there, and yeah. we're having a break, and I get these spam messages, and it's from Erin, and I'm like, the girls are like, oh, like, who's that? I'm like, oh, it's just Erin, you know? And I know, like, as soon as I said that to her, I was like, that's where I was, bad boy. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> yeah, that, yeah. I was like, yeah. Oh, yeah, it is. Like, ding, next yeah, message. Yeah. And then all of them were like, I deserve that. Like, oh, they all went off, and I'm like, oh. I know, we were just like, sitting through D&D, and you were like, pouring your heart out. And then we just jumped on, like, no, D&D can pause. Yeah, we were like, no, this no. needs to happen. And I'm like, oh, I love it, because they were like, get her over here right now. I'm like, I'm like they're like, no, no, get her over here, we'll fix it. I'm like, just give me a second, go, yeah. go. it's fine, like, she's fixed. <laughs> yeah, and then we just <laughs> fell asleep after that. Yeah. I was like, <laughs> I did not, I was like, <laughs> crying. I was like, crying, be like, I'm exhausted, I'm just gonna have a nap. <laughs> That's the best way to do it. It's like, I'm bucking, I'm going to bed. <laughs> I'm emotionally drained. Oh my God. It just knocks out. Yeah. I see that though. Yeah. I'm being fair. Oh I mean, to be fair, that was quite a while ago, so I'm pretty proud of my day. Was it last year? Was that technically? Uh, yeah. yeah. Yes, yeah. because it was right after my birthday. Yeah. <laughs> proud. Damn. I'm doing well. Mm. Right? Yeah. <laughs> I'm like mildly shocked. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't had your like, first year cry yet. Yeah. I'm like, no, I actually haven't. Like, I've been sad. But yeah. Like, I haven't, like, I've had mine. <laughs> <laughs> That's too many. Um, I probably had mine last week. Yeah. But, like, that was, um... I won't explain what it yeah. is, unfortunately. But I'm um, like, I think at that point it was like, um, no, this is like your first year cry. Mm-hmm. Congratulations. <laughs> you <Yeah, laughs> you kind of them up. Well, <laughs> but um, it's like, okay, now you can get your shit together. Now you're gonna do this. And I was like, just, I was like, so on like in the dumps. But then it's like, no, no, 2021 mm-hmm. is going to be okay. It's not gonna be a repeat, hopefully. Fingers crossed, that's not my fault, but you know. We'll see. <laughs> no, we'll see how we go. But like, yeah, that's yeah. probably, that was probably it for me, so. Yeah. Uh, probably my, uh, mine was last week, but you know. Yeah, like, yeah. Like, a lot happened. happened. It's just emotional women. That's not Bro, so much is... <laughs> Sorry, so I didn't. Much is like, <laughs> that's, that's that's fine. Fine. I just love how you're like, yeah, we're like so emotional women. I'm like, bro. Am I, <laughs> no, actually, mm. I mean, we are for like certain subjects, which I guess is like for everyone really, but like. Again, I won't go into detail about myself, but like, it was just one of those things where like, one thing happened, then yeah. the next thing, yeah. then the next thing. And it, like, it was just all these things at once, so I'm like, yeah. I just want a break, please. I want like a week where something shit doesn't happen. Yeah, yeah, no, 100%. I'm waiting for that, yeah. but you know, it's getting much better, so I'm like, okay. Yeah, yeah. sometimes you just, you do that. Sometimes you just need it. Yeah, you just you need know, it. Like, sometimes crying. it's just like, you know what, let it out, get it done, well, you know, yeah. and then just figure it out. Move on, because as you're always gonna figure it out at some point. Yeah. So yeah. It's just a matter of actually getting to that point. Yeah. No, hundred yeah. percent. How do y'all feel about each other now? <laughs> Significantly closer because yeah. <laughs> yeah. the yeah. second time we met. Yeah. yeah. It's weird because like even though this is like the proper time that we've actually spoken, I feel like we've known each other for longer yeah, only, so I was like, like, okay, cool. just even through like stories, like, yeah. through, like just cause like the way we've talked now, it just feels like we've known each other for yeah, a long time. Yeah, exactly. yeah, exactly. Yeah. I like it. Oh, it <laughs> makes, makes yeah. my little old heart happy. Yeah. <laughs> She's sitting there again, it's like, I'm proud of her. Like, right? yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I was like, I had to like stop myself from there, cause I was like, I'm so, I'm dying in my heart. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was just like doing the whole like, change the word slightly, but yeah. like, same concept. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, thank you both for doing this with me. I know it was very chaotic, but oh, it was great. Like, it was good, yeah. Of our interactions, but yeah, yeah. 100%. Pretty much, if you want to check out the other podcasts, they will be in the description below or in the iCard. Thank mm-hmm. you all so much for watching. Yeah. Again, thank you both for joining. Thank you. Yeah, thank you. Had a lot of fun. Yeah. If you <laughs> want to find any of their socials, I'll put their Instagrams in the description below <laughs> so you can see the chaos that is our lives. Oh, yeah. Mine's so edgy. <laughs> <laughs> Mine's all over the place. Yeah, or whatever <laughs> social yeah. they give me, depending on what they feel yeah. like. Um, if not, 
you'll definitely see the current night on the channel a lot yes. and Era will be popping in all throughout because she, somewhere <laughs> yeah, she's, yeah. Yeah. she's sprinkling throughout eventually <laughs> she's like the like not official member <laughs> that sounds really bad you're our guest you have the black oh cup. yes thank yeah. you yeah. my cup now yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay, okay, that is now Aaron's cup yeah true yeah that. so for, again just quick context for people who are unaware everyone it sounds like a club i hate this yeah, <laughs> it was like every club, club. <laughs> yeah so like the the main four yeah, we'll grab. But like, you know, you got Alyssa, Caitlin, Dakota, and I, we all have like mugs and they're all color associations. So for example, like mine is blue. What do you describe your color as? Um, I want to say pink, but I really don't. So just pretend it's red. <laughs> I was going to say like a blush type of color. Yeah, yeah. Like a pink. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. We'll say it's a blush. Yeah, they're, they're both um, Pantone mugs. So because my design is, <laughs> and then the other girls have like yellow and peach. I don't know, I'm looking at them, I'm like, what color are they again? Yeah. yeah, yeah, they're like a <laughs> yellow and peach color. Mm. But and, and then I have a guest mug. Yeah, and then we have like a guest yeah. mug which is black and white because why not? Yeah, we we bought them and we we're like, yep, this will work. But they were cheap, so it's like yeah. good luck. Came up, love it. Sorry, right. we thought about it a lot. There's a lot of more. <laughs> <laughs> I will take care of it. Yeah. We're, we're, and be we're, like we're trying to find a purple mug actually. Yeah, yeah. Like, that'd be perfect. And I'm like, yes, but we couldn't find one anywhere. Aww. Yeah, I swear. So, Anytime you see a purple mug, hit me up. Okay. Be like, Jada, it's here. Yeah. I'll call you and be like, I'll yeah. get this mug for you. <laughs> yeah, please. I'll literally give you money for it. Like, yeah. It's like, I know I've claimed a black mug, but like, I found a purple one. <laughs> it's like, for this one, however. Yeah. It's purple. No, 100%. Yeah. Alrighty. Anyway, thank you both. I know, I literally yeah, said that was my own tangent. Yeah, I'll yeah, just kind of rewrap it. That's pretty much all good. Yeah. We'll see you all in the next podcast. Yeah. Bye. 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 Bye.